Hi guys. Okay, today's phonics lesson is just reading practice, okay? So we're going to practice coding these words and reading these words. And then if you get it right, you can check off the box. And if you get it wrong, you'll circle it. And that's how you know to practice that one, okay? Remember, it's okay to get things wrong. So the first one we're going to do is O-R. Now we remember from our digraphs that O-R says or. How do we code that one? Do you remember? Here's a little hint with an arc underneath. Good, okay? So we're gonna draw an arc under that OR and then it's by itself, so it just says OR. Okay, if you get it right, put a little check in the box. If you did not get it right, circle it. Now we're gonna look at number two. OR is right here again, so I'm gonna code it again. And then I notice I have an F and an OR. Mm, that one's probably pretty easy. All right, look down here. Oh my gosh, it looks like the same word, but with an F in the front and a T at the end. Now, Miss Taylor is not going to read these words for you. All I'm gonna do is code them, and then your job is to read them, okay? Remember, OR says OR. We're gonna come down here. Ooh, this is AR. Do you remember what AR says? AR says R, and it gets a arc underneath. Okay, we're gonna code it by putting an arc under it, and then there's a C in front, so it's k -r, car. Good, if you get it right, check it out. This one has the same word in it, but there's an S in the front. Hmm, I wanna make sure I code my AR, good. This one also has an AR in it, but there's only one letter. <coughs> what you'll notice is that this word is the same as this word, with a new letter on the front. And that's what they've been doing for all of these, okay? Code your AR with an R because that means it stays together to say R. Okay, we're gonna come up here to number eight. Oh my gosh, it looks like a big word, but don't worry. It's the same as this word with one extra letter on the end. So if you read this word, then you can read this word. Okay, the next one is ER. Now, does anyone remember what ER says? ER says er. This butter is much better. It says er. Okay? We mark it with an arc. H, er, h, er, her. Check it off if you get it right. If not, that's okay. All right, we're gonna jump in here. Ooh, here's our AR again, but it's at the front with one letter at the end. Hmm, I wonder what that's gonna be. And then if you look, it's actually the same next word with a new beginning sound on it. Okay, good. This one, we jump back over here to our OR, and there's the beginning sound and an ending sound. I bet you can blend that one. Remember, OR says OR. And then this last one looks like a lot of letters, but don't worry. We have one, two, we have our or, and then we have this one. And I bet you can read that. Now this one is circled because it does not follow the rules. It is a sight word. It is the sight word R, okay? It's kind of like if it looked like this. That's how we pronounce it, R, okay? Good job coding with me. I want you to go back and read all these words. If you get them, check it off. If not, circle it, and then we can always go back and practice it later. Thanks, guys.